Hey there, everybody. Welcome back. I thought I would show, uh, share something uh, special with you. In Final Fantasy XIV, they have added new content with the latest patch. And what that is, is called Stone Sky C. Now, Stone Sky C is basically a, a short trial where you fight a, a striking dummy. And if you can destroy the striking dummy within the time allotted, it means that you're ready for certain kinds of high-level content. What this is meant to address is a lot of the drama in the game. And Square Enix is getting very hard-nosed about this drama where uh, people are being criticized, people are being ostracized, and even discriminated against because they don't have the right gear per um, their opinion. And there's a lot of drama, a lot of arguing, a lot of screaming, and Square Enix has had it. Now, according to their rules, they don't allow uh, DPS meters, basically a uh, third-party tool that lets that analyzes data from the game to determine how much damage you're putting out. And so what they've done is they have created something that's not quite a DPS meter. It doesn't tell you how much damage you're putting out. Basically the striking dummy is has enough HP based on what kind of creatures you'll be going up against in high level content and so if you can destroy it within a particular period of time you are doing more damage than what's needed and that's what stone sky c is is supposed to be for it's not a dps meter but it's to show that hey i beat stone sky c i'm ready for this dungeon i'm ready to kill the stuff that's in it all right, so let's get into it. And how you start it is you talk to the goodly adventurer outside the gate to Idleshire, which is the new hub town for Final Fantasy XIV. Fight? Okay, basic training. I've never run this before. Now, the basic training, uh, this is a starter level, this is for Discipline of War and Magic. Uh, and then there is Limitless Blue Extreme. Yeah, this is, um, this is to see if you're ready to handle uh, Bismarck Extreme. And then Alexander Gordias. I am now I level. Can't like it. I'm I level 206. I recently got my hands on some new um, esoteric gear. I have to run the um, Void Arc a few more times to get up some more. Um, you get these Miyachi. Um, some kind of Miyachi coins, and you use those in Idleshire with an NPC to buy um, specific kinds of um, like ingredients. You get twine, you get a, um, a, like a coating um, liquid. I forget the, the names that, that uh, there are for them. But depending on what the piece of gear is that you're trying to upgrade, you uh, you get that item, and then you go back and you turn it in to a um, a character that's in Idleshire. She's a dolmen. She won the dolmen race, and you give it to her, and she will. And you give her the item. You have to actually unequip it. You hand it to her. You hand her the the um, item that will upgrade it. And then she'll hand you back another item, and then it will change what this is. And I've done this with my weapon, which this is, was the esoterics weapon, but now it's this. 
And I've done this with, um, with my, see, I've done this with the legs, and I did it with the body piece. And the reason why it's shifting names here is because I have this, um, glamoured. And I have the legs glamoured. And I have the bow glamoured with, um, the meat artifact weapon, which is the, uh, my glowy weapon. This one can also be continuously upgraded. I just recently unlocked the quest line that lets you that lets you uh, upgrade this to an anima weapon. So it'll change its appearance over time and it will have different glowing effects on it and everything. It, it makes it into a much more powerful version of what it is now. So let's go into the basic training stone sky see i've never done this before so i have no idea what this does so you're, you're you're going along with me for the first time so let's start All right it teleports us Kill this dummy. Another thing also is I had a pretty nasty um, echo problem with my um, microphone. I hope I solved that. I looked up some tutorials on Open Broadcast and I found that there was a common um, problem. I, what I did was I had the audio enabled on uh, the webcam. Not on the webcam, but when you, when you set up your sources, you had the webcam for and you had the audio enabled. I thought you had to have the audio enabled for that, um, to pick up my voice on here, but it's separate. So I was actually recording, um, you know, double the sound, and I think that was creating a problem with the uh, audio buffer. And so over time, it was creating echo effects that just get worse and worse and worse and worse and worse. And I'm going to kill this thing. Ooh, it's close. I got it. Alright, I killed it in time. I am ready for the beginner. Now there's somebody else over here. Still in there. Oh, black mage. That's the that's the job I'm gonna that's the job and class I'm gonna be playing. Today. Job and class I'm gonna be playing. Today. I've got a thaumaturge character. And I'm going to be 
playing that next now that I've now that I've leveled up my bard as far as I can at the moment. All right now you talk to the Pathfinder and you go back to him. Alright, and that was Stone Sky Sea. Um, basically, it lets you know, you know, just how much damage you're putting out. Um, may have to adjust some things. I may have to adjust how quickly I um, use some of my actions. As, as you see, there's a global cooldown for some, but there are others that don't have a global cooldown. And I'm not animate. I don't. I don't have animation lock. So like, bloodletter. I can immediately do another action immediately after bloodletter. And also um, with um, sidewinder. So I have some tweaking to do there. But this shows me that for any of the content that I want to go into, I'm ready. I will run the um, the other ones later. So I just wanted to show you, this is what Stone Sky Sea is all about. And you have to destroy that uh, striking dummy within a particular period of time. And if you can destroy it within the allotted time, that means that you are all set. You are ready to go. There should be no arguments. Right? And I thank you for coming along with me on this little trip. I've been Mike. This has been Final Fantasy XIV. You'll see some more videos later. Bye.